You know, I'm, I'm done with this fucking phone. It just keeps turning off because it loses space. You know, fuck you, fucking phone. Fuck you. Go suck a fucking dick, you fucking motherfucker. All right? You know, I don't give a shit all the storage shit. Apple, put more storage. Just put it all. I don't give a shit how much it costs. Just put it. That's the whole point of this. I'm not going to fucking upgrade to one terabyte or, or none of this shit. PS5, Xbox, whatever the next Xbox is. You know, I don't even... You know, I'm actually not hyped for the next console because this one is, I don't know, it, it, it's underwhelming. Underwhelming. Everybody's just greedy as fuck. They're barely releasing any games, any game that's actually worth a damn, worth a shit. They're all fucking point. They're all fucking unfinished messes. You pretty much buy the game and it's an unfinished mess. You got to fucking update the shit out of it. With patches and all this dumb shit. Fuck you. I'm not paying for none of that. I'm not waiting for that. The game... Just finish now! Finish now! Cause I paid for it. I paid those sixty dollars now. Put everything in the game. I don't give a fuck. Fuck you. Should all be in the game now. Fuck you. Fuck the internet. Get rid of the internet. I hope the internet. It's just cause it's just ruining everything. These corporations are all sucking fucking dick. They're all fucking. Oh my god! It pisses me the fuck off. These retarded corporations. They just fucking ruin everything. That's all they know what to do. Just ruin everything. Just fucking. Fucking cash grab the shit out of fucking uh, all, all all the cool shit. Gaming should stay for fucking nerd. That shit, it was better for fucking nerds. You know, it was better than. It, 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 I hope it stays like that. Cause man, these fucking dumbasses, they come in and just ruin everything. These casuals ruin everything. They ruin everything. Ruin movies. Ruin music. Ruin entertainment. Ruins all. Cause they fucking ruin it. Oh, oh, oh this is this. Oh, you know, fuck you. It, it it should be like that. It's fucking entertainment. Nobody gives a shit how it's supposed to be. If it's too complicated to understand. You know what? Probably because you're fucking st too slow to understand shit like that. You're too fucking slow. That's probably why you guys just watch football. You gotta fucking ruin everything else for everyone. You can ruin gaming. You want every game to be the fucking same. You know, hey. At least, hey. At least there's a fucking backfire. I mean, somewhat of resistance, I guess. Look what happened with Battlefield. Look what happened with, um... Um... Mm, a division? I don't, I don't even know. I don't even know what's... Days Gone's coming out, I guess. I guess it's coming out. I can't think of anything else. I know Days Gone... I'm getting it. Well, I'm not now. I'm going to get it when they lower the price because it doesn't look like a $60 game. Looks like 20 $20 games. You know what I think? Lower the damn prices of these games. They, they ain't worth $60. That's the first thing to begin with. These games ain't worth $60. None of them are. Red Dead is probably the only one that's probably worth the damn. Last of Us? But again, un they make great games, but once you beat them, then what? You know, lower the fucking prices. 20 bucks is the maximum I'm willing to pay. Like Within a year, shit's $20. Horizon Zero Dawn. Remember the hype for that one? Already $20. Game of the Year Edition, $20. Uncharted 4. Remember the hype around that? 10 bucks. I think I got it for. Or maybe less. Maybe, I don't know, yeah. Battlefield 1. Five fucking dollars. Imagine being the fucking dumbass that paid 60 for this. You paid $60 for this fucking game. And I was, I got, and then, not even two, barely two years later, it's five bucks. Five bucks. The last Battlefield is the same price as World War II. Call of Duty World War II. That's embarrassing, man. I feel bad for the people buying games. And people that buy sports games, you're stupid. Because they just downgrade. It's a downgrade every fucking year, pretty much. It used to be upgrade every fucking game. It's better and better and better. Then came this, this generation. The console was like the 14 area. Like the NBA 2K14, Madden 25. Uh, I think that was it. Once this console started, was the peak, and then... <laughs> ah, it got worse. It just gets worse and worse and worse. It just went to full shit. I saw what happened with Madden. The custom character... The custom char characterization is a fucking joke. Does that even count? They have 50 face and half of them they all look the same. You know, dumb motherfuckers. I saw that video. If you buy sports games now, you're stupid. And plus, they lose the value within like six months. So it was like, what's the fucking point? The fucking point in buying that. 2K14 is three bucks at GameStop. Three bucks. 
I think I bought it day one because I I didn't have my ID so I couldn't get Battlefield 4. And I, I kind of got out it did. Now the game is like five bucks. I can buy it if I want to, but I don't want it. Next game I'm probably going to get is Titanfall 2 because, again, five bucks. Mortal Kombat, XL, Injustice 2. Dread, I know you're recommending me. I'm definitely going to get those eventually. Alien Isolation. I love the Alien. I love Alien. So that's the one I want. Uh, what else do I want? I should get a racing game. Because there, there ain't any good ones, really. Like, the only one I'm pretty much going to get is Need for Speed Rivals. I don't know any good... Payback, I think that one failed. Let me check. I haven't heard nothing from Need for Speed Payback. I know the other one before Payback and after Rivals. The Need for Speed Reboot. I heard that one is just online only. Fuck you, I'm not paying to pay with fucking nerds on the internet. Need for Speed Payback, here we go. The review. Oh, fuck, seven minutes. I'm not gonna spend seven minutes watching this shit. So look at the comments. Black Friday, what the fuck? Let's be real here, guys. We need it. Yeah, new min. That's one I want. Midnight Club Burnout. I want the return of those two right now. Midnight Club and Burnout. Why don't, yeah, why don't they just remaster the old games? Like, the old games are better than the new ones, so I was like, what's the fucking point? Backwards compatibility on the new consoles. Killzone. PS5, I heard it's gonna have 8K. PS5, I heard it's gonna have 8K. Or whatever, I don't know, man. But I heard it's gonna be a powerful console. But I'm not getting it. Unless they add backwards compatibility for the fucking PS3. Where is the game? This is the one. This is the whole reason I want it. I'll get the PS4. If they add backwards compat... Oh, fuck. Compatibility. These are the games I'm gonna get for. Where are they? Gotta look for them. Oh, fucking hidden. These are the games. The main games. The whole reason to get a PS3. Because they were just so fucking badass, bruh. So bad. I, it sucks that we haven't gotten them. Well, we got one at the beginning, and then, but like the other ones we haven't gotten shit for. I mean, the other one hasn't has gotten shit for. Where is it? This, these games. Now, these are mostly this one. This one's the main one. This. This is the reason. To add backwards compa compatibility on the PS3, PS5, PS3 backwards compa compatibility. These three games the most. This one, Resistance, Light, 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 Light. Light. This one, Resistance Fall of Man, biblical fucking game. Better than any fucking shooter out today. Resistance 2, again, another one. All these shooters are better than whatever the fuck is out now. Or whatever shooters, first person shooters. I can't really think of, this one's, bib. this is the best one. Everybody go buy this one. This one is even better. This this game kicks fucking ass, bro. Now this one, the granddaddy of them all. What, start, what started the badass first person shooter, whatever the fuck. This is, imagine this 8K on a PS5 with... All that fucking epic feature, epic features it's meant to have and shit. All the, all of that. Killzone Two. This is the this I want this on PS Five. Remaster, remaster all of these fucking games on PS Five right now. All of this. Look at that. All of these badass mo these bad boys, man. That on PS Five. I'll get a PS Five. If not, well, you better have some good fucking games coming in. I mean, there's some good good shit I'm in. I like Spider Man's definitely one I'm gonna get. God of War, Horizon, twenty bucks. I can buy it. Uncharted. But it's like how how the then I gotta think how is Sony gonna top those games? How the fuck are they gonna top that? How are they gonna top it? 
because I don't know. I don't. I don't have confidence. They're gonna. They're gonna not gonna be able to top it. How? How did? How did Xbox One top 360 exclusives? They did not. They did not. All of them. Her fucking trash. Trash. Gears of War 4. Probably the only reason I'll get an Xbox One. I like Gears of War. Halo. The fuck. This shit fell off. That Halo fell off big time. That game. That shit fell off, bro. That fell off. Mm. There's another game I wanted remastered on the current consoles. This one. This I want this one to come back. Infamous 2, bro. They got to bring Infamous back. Infamous was badass. They're making Ghost of Tsushima. That actually looks good. I like samurai games. Games that, you know, Japanese culture or whatever the fuck. Alrighty, I guess. So PS5 and all this shit, bro. They better be good, bro. I'm not hype. I'm not excited. I don't. I have zero confidence with these fucking companies now. After after this generation, everybody's just being a gr bunch of greedy pieces of shit. Fucking monetizing and, you know, fuck you. I'm not excited. You know, can't wait for the PS5 and X and the next Xbox to come out as soon as they launch. Sports games and maybe Call of Duty 30, a new Battlefield, maybe. You know, probably nothing special. Remember the games that when the PS4 and Xbox One released? Remember those games? Do you, does anybody still play them? Or are any of them like that really get that good? Battlefield 4 is probably the only one I, I remember being good enough. Um, I think that's it, yeah. That's probably it. Dead Rising 3. I hope, I hope Dead Rising comes back. I heard to shut down the studio. I like Dead Rising. I like killing zombies. It was a fun zombie killing game. Bring it back, Capcom. Bring back Dead Rising and Dino Crisis. I want that shit to come back. Make gamers... I hope they treat gamers like no lives again. It's, it's a lot better like that, you know. Instead of getting all these fucking nerds coming in. Ruining this shit, you know. What happened with uh, the Sakari, Sekiryu? Shadows die twice. Everybody wants an easy mode because they fucking suck at the game. They suck at it, and now they want they want that game to be like the others. They want they just want to dominate. They want to dominate because they fucking suck. Because they can't dominate in person, so they you know they want to dominate in, in in a game. You know, not, they can't dominate in real life, man. Fucking pissed. Don't add easy mode. Easy mode's for fucking nerds. I beat Dead Space two on the hardest difficulty. How many people can say that? Huh? Only I can. Only a beast like me can do that shit in, in a fucking game. Um, yeah, gaming should be for nerds, and it should stay like that. It should stay like that. We can't have these fucking retarded casual people coming in and just ruining every, every, games like they did with music and movies and sports and all of that shit. You know, they they like ruining everything. Casuals ruin everything. End of story. Thirteen. Oh fuck. I'm high. Ah!